Hello and welcome to the transcription explanation of this design. So this was made to be an engraving on a ring, hence the lines being super small and consistent in size because this is just going to be a path that my laser is going to follow when engraving the ring. And these dots are made by actually a couple concentric circles uh, to make them a little bit thicker and so on and so forth. So anyway, these are five words that are kind of separate and just built to kind of describe this father, which is this gift, um, which is who this gift is going towards for Father's Day. Anyway, so when you read this script, you start at the bottom and you go counterclockwise, like a time traveler going back in time. So this unraveled version, this first letter will be at the bottom. So we have this deep divot with one line attached to it, so that would be the G. Lines that pass through letters do not count. Then we have an A. An A is outside the word circle, so shown here or also shown here. And then we have an M. One, two, three lines on the M, and then the E, like a beat on a string, is attached on the word circle, and then an R with three dots. So E's are on the line of the word circle or centered in a consonant, where A's are outside and O's are inside or attached on the consonant stems themselves. So internal, central, outside. And then I's and U's have lines. So G, A, M, E, R. And then this marker here is the start marker. So right here we have our start and orientation marker, and that tells you you start reading this design at the bottom here. I probably should have also put one here, but there was an A there. No, it's fine. This is still fine. Because I have this design repeated um, here, and this is all mirrored with this one being this direction as well. But I really liked the symmetry I had going here, and I didn't want to put one of these here and make it non-symmetrical. So anyway, gamer is our first word. Then we have intelligent. I, I, NT with four dots because we can do an NT as one letter with four dots. E, double L. Why is that not? Double L. I, I has a line going inwards. A G has one line on it. So this is the one line on the G. And then we're missing the E here as well. E, NT. Oh yeah, that's right, because I had them separated in the design. So this is the I line going inwards, G, G, one line, E, E, and then again an NT with four dots. So that would be intelligent. And then we have committed. So C with four dots, one, two, three, four, O inside, a double M is a double line. So just like the double L here, we can do the M as a double line with one, two, three modifying lines on it. So these two get stacked on top of each other with the I going inwards, and here's the T, and then the TE, and then the D with one, two, three dots. So that would be committed. Then we have my favorite part of the design. We have an A outside the word circle, a double line for a double S, H with one, two lines, O, L, and then E. And then we have father. F has one, two, three lines, A outside the word circle, T, H with two lines, E, and then an R, and I actually have the TH together, and uh, the HE together in this one, so it'd be uh, T, TH, no, T-H-E, there we go, R, with three dots. And then this is the same thing repeated, just upside down, so if you were to flip the ring over, that's, that's what you'd get, because it's the same thing, upside down and flipped. So yeah, that is that, I hope you like it. Thanks, bye.